All right, let's get Somali, the Somalian person. What's happening? Hop on, man. How you doing, Tariq? Uh, we spoke last time. I brought up the question about the um, uh, what to do as a black person in the corporate community if uh, if you're trying to um, bypass the system of white supremacy. I live in Boston. That a uh, couple of things I wanted to touch up on. That Ethiopian tether that spoke before me, that guy does not represent East Africa at all. Um, he's just the person that's bucking to the white system. As soon as he comes here, he thinks he's better than everyone. Uh, I've been on yeah. both sides. I've been on both sides. I've seen what it's like to be around white folks, and I've seen what it's like to be around foundational Black Americans such as yourself. And the treatment is completely, obviously different. Um, I, I get much more love from you guys. Um, uh, two things. Uh, last time you never spoke on the um, issue for reparations in Boston. What do you think should be the next step? Should we ignore that? Uh, should we should, should we not even pay attention to it? And well, you know what? I gotta look. Hold on, hold on. I gotta look into it. I don't know what the the plan is out there, because they got all of these little reparations programs that they're popping up now. They're calling them reparations, and when you look at the fine print, the shit looks real janky. So when I hear reparations, I'm like, let me see the rest of what that shit says. You got some stuff out here. I saw some. They're talking about reparations for Mexicans. Um. We, we got to watch when some says reparations. We got to read the fine print now, man. We got to read every little bit of everything. We got to read everything they they throw out here talking about some damn reparations because they know that's a buzzword now. The grassroots, we made the word reparations hot. So now they're going to use that and try to trick bag it up. So I don't know what the Boston reparations thing is. I have no idea what's in it. I don't know who's who's the, the author of the, the document. I don't know any of that. So I would have to look at that. Reparations, just saying it, that ain't good enough no more. We got to get into the meat and potatoes. Reparations for who? Well, people who experience racism, no. Yeah, yeah, I put up a clip of a guy who's um, was a Guinean from Guinea, and he had a do-rag on covering up his damn hairline, trying to blend in, talking about, we need reparations. 400 year of oppression we need we need we need reparations i'm like whoa 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 so yeah we gotta we really gotta get this thing straight about who's supposed to be getting what and all that because now people are trying to hide hairlines and 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 put janky ass documents out here so we need to really get this bullshit cleared up it's a lot of funny style stuff going on out here when the, the, the word reparations we didn't made it a hot topic so now everybody wants to get on that bandwagon. So we got to watch every word. All right. 